everyone! We are back, my sister is <laughs> back with me here and today we are going to show you some five products each that we really like. It's our five top favorites, yeah. of course. And we did two other videos with before. The first one was when she was applying my makeup for the first time <laughs> ever. Uh, and on anyone on anyone <laughs> of course and this is the result so if you want to see that video it's going to be listed down below so you can check it out after this one of course and the second video we did together was uh, when we showed kind of five products I said five almost five I was cheating, cheating a, lot. a little bit <laughs> a little bit just a little bit uh, product that didn't work for us so today we are going to be more positive than the last time and yes. we are going to show you the products that we really enjoy and really like so if you want to see that stay with us and don't forget to subscribe now one of my favorite products for this summer is this uh, sunscreen from Eucerin I think you call it I don't know how you pronounce it in English but that's a brand that's well known here in Sweden or in Scandinavia at all they always uh, always have products for the sun protection and like you know, when it's summer you need something to put on your face. Under makeup or without makeup you always need your sunscreen. You always need something to protect your face from the sun. Uh, and you should use it all year around, not ju just during the summer. But my face is combo to oily skin. And when I use some of the sunscreens for my face, my face gets really really greasy really oily and when I use foundation it feels really heavy and it feels like I'm oily just after a couple of hours so I hate that but this one this is sun fluid mattifying face for normal to combination skin and it's also for sensitive skin as you can see I don't know if you can see that if I can zoom that in and as, as you can see it's with SPF 50 which is the highest and it's so great to have on your skin as you can see it's kind of watery it uh, doesn't have any special sense to it so it doesn't smell like uh, sunscreen on your face but this blends in your skin amazing I'll show you this is so so good and when your skin absorbs this when my skin absorbs it it feels so matte it doesn't feel greasy at all and when you put it your foundation on your makeup on glides beautifully your makeup stays on this doesn't make your makeup stays on longer this is not a product for it you have your primers but this doesn't make your foundation disappear or for us oily girls or guys this is very good to have on your face so I do recommend this it's kind of high in price uh, but you do get a lot and this will last you a long long time I had this for almost a year now and I've been like halfway through you don't need much of this but this is so good mm -hmm. and one of my new favorites is I was <laughs> I was really negative in my last video in products that I didn't like when I was talking about cleansing products so today I have some cleansing product for you that I love love the love and this was that YouTube made me buy and this is the Garnier uh, skin active cleansing water and it's for face eyes lips no perfume and you have already seen this in other videos probably but this one was something that I was I was very curious to try this one because everybody everybody liked it and I love it too I won't talk about it a lot it does cleanse my face it takes removes all of my makeup not waterproof mascara but I have other products for that but two pads and my makeup is gone so I really like and enjoy this product doesn't make me break out too mm -hmm. I have this one of my absolute favorite foundation when it, from drugstore and it's from e.l.f. it's acne fighting foundation now I this has been used and abused as you can see the name of it it's gone <laughs> what this contains it's gone that's written here it's gone but I really really love this foundation this is called acne fighting foundation and for girls and guys who wear makeup uh, and who get, have acne or do get breakouts using makeup I think this is a very good foundation on me it does stay on for eight hours uh, I don't feel it creasing I don't feel that it disappears I don't feel that makes me oily 
I love 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 this foundation I use it often but especially uh, during month when I'm breaking out like crazy you girls all know what I'm talking about when you are in your time and you break a lot this one is to go and a foundation that I really really like and it's one of my favorites is this Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay In Place Makeup and I have the shade 2C3 Fresco and I love 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 that this, this foundation I love I'm full courage girl and I love full courage and this gives me full courage and for my oily combinated skin during summer this stays on for at least 12 hours and that's something that I love and enjoy it doesn't feel heavy doesn't feel sticky it doesn't feel like it's or greasing and uh, I love this foundation I think you saw it maybe a couple of times in my videos I was talking about uh, it earlier and I uh, love this foundation and I want to have it in this video because this foundation I can't live without it I don't use it every day because I have other foundation that I like but this is one my top one foundation now for something on for the eyes um, I did get a lot of new palettes because I am an eyeshadow collector. I have many eyeshadow palettes. I collect them, I use them, I love them. They are my babies. And one of my new favorites is this from Manager, Manager palette from Tarte. That's why I'm, I was using for Ida's today on her eyes. And this palette is so good, guys. You have so many shades. You have your mattes, you have your shimmer shades, you have your highlighter. This highlighter you can use on your face. It's so, so, so good. It smells good. It's travel friend friendly. You can make so many looks with this and I enjoy using this palette. It has a mirror so you can always check yourself, fix your makeup and uh, yeah. Okay, this is maybe going to be strange but I don't have any palette with me today to show you as my favorite because I have so many favorites I, I really right now I can't choose any of them so I will stay away from my palettes for now but I want to show you my favorite blushes or brand for blushes and this is this wet n wild color icon blushes this is in shade um, pearlescent pink and it's one of my favorite shades. This isn't my favorite, I have a couple of them, but I wanted to show you something that I use almost every day. And I love, 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 love these blushes because they stay on my skin for a long time and they are really easy to build up. They are not too powdery, they are not too pigmented so you, you look like a clown when you apply it. It's very buildable and very easy. It gives a little bit of this beautiful, nice shine, so it's not matte, matte product. But I do like it. You can see it here, and uh, I really enjoy using these Wet n Wild color icon blushes. So I do like them. I do recommend them, and they are great. I have this um, highlight product. This is a Shimmer Brick uh, Compact from uh, Bobbi Brown. This has all my fingerprints on, but this is also something that's been used and abused a lot. This is in shade Pink Quartz. And you can see mine is really dirty because I've used that a lot. And this is something you can use for your eyes, like an eyeshadow, for your highlighter, for your blush topper. Wherever you want some shimmer, you can use this. Uh, it has some different kind of shades. It has some pink shades, brown shades. It's so beautiful. When you swipe with your finger and use it like uh, your highlighter, the old shades, this is a beautiful, 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 natural looking highlighter. Now, this is not Pang Boom, you yeah, can see from Airplane highlighter. This is more subtle highlighter, which I like. I like highlighters they are buildable you can just use 
for regular day days when you're working when you're home cooking cleaning you have some makeup on you don't want your highlight to pop if you like me some people like that that's okay but that's not me I just put this on my face it gets a beautiful sheen gives you highlight as you preached once now you can pack this baby on if you want that bang boom highlight but I've never used that that way and um, I really really enjoy it uh, I know that Bobbi Brown has many many different shades but this is one of my favorites now I've seen this if I'm not wrong who made me buy it was Tati on YouTube I think she was talking about this so I got this one and I love it Okay, and a product that you made me buy, <laughs> and YouTube of course, is this Milani Baked Bronzer from, uh, this is called number 9, Dolce, I have think two shades, I like them both, but this is my favorite, and this gives you such beautiful, nice, look, nice, natural looking shine, and it's easy to build up, it stays on for the whole day, I don't look orange, it gives a nice natural sheen to your face doesn't look dirty muddy or orange on my face and I love this shade this is a beautiful beautiful shade I think I have number four too and I like that one also this one if I have to pick one of those two I will pick this number four no number nine Dolce and so the one youtuber that made me buy it it's Kathleen Lights she was uh, raving about this bronzer and I was just like I need to try this on because bronzer are really really something I love too so when I got this I didn't regret it and I love it too so I love it too so it's one of my favorites thank you <laughs> so for the last product is something you gave me for a gift now I didn't own any contouring products uh, they are cream products before this NYX before one that I had on my less favorite video you will see that she will put that on her youtube channel now one that i really 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 like and really 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 enjoy in this uh, color fix from technique and as you guys know this is a affordable brand and this is so good now the thing i was afraid of is because i'm a girl with oily skin i was afraid this is going to look so 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 greasy on my face this is going to make break me out this is going to get me oily this is going to look cocky this is going to look heavy but no it did not look nothing that I just said it looked amazing it blends wonderful it's creamy not oily you don't need a lot you see I just just tapped it once and oh god girls guys this is good this is so affordable you see i blend this in oh, and it's not you can shit. mess this up so i bought that because uh, you don't have so much experience with uh, creamy, creamy contour, contour yes. palette so she was asking me do you know a palette that i can try like a beginner and don't mess mess it up so i was researching a little bit and i found that one and i'm happy that you like it I'm happy that this is so affordable and so great. I really, really love it. So, thank you. <laughs> and last product that I have for you today. It's no surprise, everyone. It's a product that, I, that I'm talking about all the time on my YouTube cha channel for the last month. And it's this Lava Art Compact Cushion Foundation. I know, I know, you heard this before, I know. And this is something that Facebook made me made me buy, but oh my god, I love this foundation. Every time when I'm in hurry, when I want full coverage, I don't have a lot of time doing my face, putting on makeup, and I want light feeling. This isn't, this isn't heavy at all, look, this is all messy and it's almost empty, so I'm waiting for my next package, but my god, this is the best, best foundation ever. And it gives me full coverage, it give, gives me mm, such a beautiful, nice shine, not oily, and it feels so light, and it has so many good things in here, and it does have SPF 50, 
Oh, that's it great. Does have SPF 50, and I was kind of afraid that it would make me very oily and make me break out, but no, it didn't. This is a beautiful product, and I do recommend it. This is, uh, I think, a Korean brand. The only thing that I don't like with this, not that I don't like, that I think is kind of strange, they only have four shades. But this is number a second shade, it's number 23 that I have, and it's a good match for my skin. I really, really enjoy this foundation. So I'm sorry for reminding you again and talking about this again, but I really, really love this foundation, and I want to show you it. If you haven't seen any of my videos, I don't want you to miss this review. So I love this one. Love, love, love. Second favorite, I have to say. Well, that was everything, guys. Yeah. Uh, that was everything that we had for you today. I hope you were very positive and I hope ha find something that you like. If you like these, us two together and want to see more videos with us two together, so give a thumbs up. If you already, have, already haven't, please don't forget to subscribe. If you want something more from us too, doing something special, you have any ideas, please yes. give us some comments down below. We read them all. And uh, yeah, I was enjoying being here. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you so much for being here with me today and uh, sharing your experience and your thoughts about a couple of products. And thank you everyone, everyone for watching. See you in my next video. Bye! Bye.